What's up everyone, Ryan here, and I'm back with another PGA 2K23 Challenge Series video. And today, I'm returning to the Impossible Challenge Series. And in this series, I take on some of the hardest golf courses in the game on extreme course conditions and try to get to a score of even or better on Master TGC Tours difficulty settings. And today, I'm continuing my journey at the truly impossible golf course, Central Park AG, designed by the legend Alan Greenspun. And today will make my 37th attempt at this golf course. That's right, our 37th week on this challenge. But in the past five, six weeks, we have been playing some great golf here in the Impossible Challenge series. We were so close one round. We were sitting two over par. We finished two over par two strokes off which is the best score so far uh, last week we were seven over par but we had a great back nine a two over back really last week could have been the week the week before could have been the week i mean honestly any of these last five weeks could have been the week but it's going to take that perfect round of golf combined with luck right we know that last week we played good golf we didn't have the luck uh, so is today a tip number 37 the day that we finally take down central park ag and complete the impossible challenge series i think today could be the day get your one times ready get your positive encouraging comments ready just like always if y'all get some enjoyment drop a like it really helps the channel subscribe for more and stay tuned to the gamer building youtube channel each and every day for new videos and here we go you all already know the course central park ag by alan greenspun the settings are the same back tees pin location number four very high winds blowing in the north direction very firm fairways very firm greens and very fast green speeds with default time of day and weather yeah very extreme unplayable course conditions but that doesn't stop me from trying this challenge for our 37th attempt at central park ag today could be the day everybody our first impossible challenge video of february let's do this get your one times ready get your coffee get your snacks whatever you need let's get fired up for a great round hello there and welcome to the game that is pga tour 2k23 Hoping you're up for some good old-fashioned fun today. Par four is on the slate for this first hole today. Let's start this off in style. Put that one right up the middle. I like the say? way you think, John. Some good old-fashioned fun here. Now, I know some of you are worried. If you saw my swing this week, if you watched my other videos, swing has been, <laughs> swing has been off this week. Let's just leave it at that. But... If you watched Ryan Gamer's performance in the major tournament finale in the PGA 2K23 career mode, you all are fired up going into this one. That happened just yesterday. So maybe we can harness that swing. Here we go. A tip number 37. First drive. You made good contact. That's a great start. That is a great start. We, I believe, split this fairway in half. Never before seen for Ryan Gamer actually splitting a fairway in half. <laughs> Second shot here on the first. Okay, decisions to make. Decisions to make. Three twenty-eight downhill, thirteen feet. Driver's definitely the play. Look at this lie. This is the best driver lie we've ever had. Eighty-five to eighty-six percent. This might be the best spot we've ever been in. And we moved the lie to 89%, changing the tacking angle there. I like this a lot, YouTube. This could be the one. You must be feeling lucky. Take That's a driver the off best the spot turf. we've ever been in for the second shot. And we Going know that when we hit it up here. to this fairway... We have our best score. Actually, our best score of this hole was a hole out for Birdie way back in that fairway. Well done. This one's your third. But other than that, when we get a little risky on this golf hole, good things happen. 78 yards, uphill two feet, into a slight cross headwind. Going to put some backspin on this. Send it out to the right and just hope we plant this up on the green. Now, this uphill lie and side hill lie is definitely going to be a factor on this golf shot. Had to be very careful. 
That's great. That is perfect. On, kick left. Go in the hole. That may go in. Oh, that's a great shot, though. A great chance at par here on the first gauntlet nice golf done. hole. The gauntlet well challenge. Hole one, hole okay. two, Positive thoughts. hole Let's six, right hole here. 12. Number nine I would throw in there as well. Those are the gauntlet, impossible gauntlet holes. Here we go. Nine, nine footer. Putt we, I do not believe we've had before. Believe it or not. Not breaking much at all. Some of you said, Ryan, you need to practice swing on the first putt. And yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Because <laughs> you all have seen my swing playing on that first putt of the day. And you all get really worried. I would too. So far, so good. What a start. Okay, starting things off today at even par. A, a par on this uh, golf hole is like an eagle. Catch out there yet. And this one's clocking in at a par four. All right, act like you've been there before. We got this. You know, in last he, last week, I had a, like an intensity, I had a certain intensity and a certain focus. I'm gonna try to keep that focus uh, in today's round as well. I, I was focused before. I hit the range a lot. I tried to really dial in the swing, and, and see if it pays off. The 245 yard. What mark. a start. 247 yards left, which is a perfect spot for this three hybrid here with this wind. It's going to get over the trees. Okay, this is ideal, YouTube. This is... Like, this is dream scenario. Get out of there. What happened there, Ryan? We may get lucky, though. We got lucky on the hole out on this golf hole. You remember that? So when we had the hole out in this golf hole, the truly impossible hole out, that's what it did, but it hit the pin and went in, right? Yeah, this is, your this third is a shot. nightmare scenario. There, we just can't get this ball to stop. We're into this upslope. The only way we get this ball to have a chance to putt is if we land it like here, exactly here, not too far up that slope to the left, not anywhere to the right. It's got to be right here. And we're hitting from a 62 to 76 percent lie you know that was just the nerves hitting you you know hole number two the impossible challenge or even i slowed that and pushed it just didn't give it a chance that's frustrating all right one shot at a time one shot at a time youtube That's it. That's perfect. You can't hit it any better than that. See, if we hit that further, it's rolling off to the cup from here. From the rough. That's like the only spot we can hit that ball. That's beautiful. But we have a tough putt left. A putt that if we miss and go for it, that is a probably double bogey scenario. This is tough. This is really tough. Okay, now the good news is we're up the hill at the beginning. The bad news is, see how that heavy left to right slope? If we miss this, it's going, it could potentially go down to the right. But let's just make it. One time right here. One time right done. here, baby! Which one of you all just one time that? Was that all of you all, you legends? Are you kidding me? What a dream start. Stay there at even par. Get your coffee, whatever you're drinking. Wind on this hole. It gets real, though, when you're even through, through two. Like, it, 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 it's a different type of nerves that hit you here. Or that hit me. Come on, Ryan. You want to win or do you want to lose? I want to win. I 
that's a great shot. That's a great shot. It's going to be a bit too far, but we can chip that up close. Maybe even chip it in. That's okay. No worries. We'll be on the green soon. Honestly, enough. this is the spot I want to be in if I'm not putting. I want to be putting, obviously. But I don't want to have the chip shot to the right. It's a really tough one. This one, we just kind of slide from right to left. Nothing fancy. Go right. It should go right. Oh, it's going to stop. Does it ever stop? I'm liking that one. Nice chip. I'm telling you okay, all, this golf course car. makes no sense. I, you know, many of you know at this point, if you watch this whole series, you know this golf course is alive. And when it wants the ball to stop, it will stop. When you want it to keep going, it will stop. This course does whatever it wants. What well a start. Done. Look at Ryan, number one. <laughs> Is that what he did? Did he do the number one? Stay at even par. Settle down, Ryan. Par five ahead of us here. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ouch, there's a Oh hook. no. It is a good thing we aimed well to the right. Where did that come from? Go in the bunker, please. If it doesn't, oh, this is great. This is great. If that goes in the rough, it is a nightmare. Right, let's this is great. So we can hit the same exact shot we would have anyways. Hey, luck is on our side today. Luck is on our side today. That's perfect. This is going to go exactly where we want it. And we're going to have a shot at this. We're going to actually have a, a shot at this. One of the most nerve-wracking shots right, on this golf course. Out of the bunker, back into the fairway. Good we actually have an 8-iron. Setting up here 145 yards away. Okay, I need everybody to one-time this like they've never one time before. Maybe you haven't. Well, now's your chance to make up for, for lost time of, of one-timing. Now, keep in mind, I'm not getting too carried away on this one. You want to win or do you want to lose here? says do not hit it in the water keep that in mind come on kick to the right actually that would have been perfect if that swing plane and fast one have happened but we're in great chance well, you tried you just didn't quite hit the par tree. maybe even birdie Setting up in the green side rough just about Pop this is a scary shot this is a very scary shot because if we miss hit this chip shot, the ball is gone and our chance for par goes away. Come on. One time. Truck it good. Go ball. A bit too short. short. We had the line. We had the it line. Might be nice to save par on this one. One of the most nerve-wracking putts you will hit on this golf course, besides hole number twelve, obviously. And the reason is, if you miss it, you're out of bounds. And a miss here is only really caused by a missed input. Looking good. Beautiful. Good job in there with a par. Today could be the and day. Even par currently. Friday. On this one, February uh, second. Three ahead of us. It is February second today, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. All right. Go do two yards. We know what to do here. Don't send it up to the left. Send it here in that bunker or rough on that side. Maybe we get lucky. If not, it's all right. That's great. That is great. That's exactly what we want to do right there. A nice and smooth shot hitting into the sand or the rough. Give herself a chip. A wayward on the approach. That's all right, though. Now that, don't get me wrong, up here, green side, rough. the shot we have here is not easy, 
But when you're up behind that, it's almost impossible. Very fitting for the impossible challenge, right? <laughs> Ryan, in 37 attempts, you've said impossible. You've said the word impossible a thousand times. Oh. Huh. Huh. Have I? 89 to 94% lie. 12 yard chip shot. This is such a scary shot. We lend it short, it's coming back. We land too far, it's gonna still roll back. I don't even know what to do here, to be honest with you all. It's gonna and look at this lie. Like, what are we supposed to do here? I don't even know. Good shot. That's a good shot. That's about, honestly, the best we can do from there. That's actually pretty amazing. Wow. Might be about the closest we can hit it from there. And then we have the okay. tester. Here's a power putt. A putt we've had a million times. This putt's good so far. You know, in recent weeks, we've had that putt every time. <laughs> it's good. How does that, that stop, one? dude? These Just are 186 green speeds. Look at the top right. This course gave us one. We have luck on our side. What? How, how many weeks in a row have we had that same putt? We have not missed it in like 15 weeks. We have not missed that putt in 15 weeks. Swing plane was dead straight, too. It just shot off the club face. We got lucky though. Luck is on our side. I. I. That's heartbreaking, but hey, that saves the round. We know that putt's not easy. That saves the round. Looking pretty good. Luck is on our side today. Good job. That's and we're playing Bobby. great golf. Could today be the day? And you're sitting at one over par at the moment. Holt number six. Nothing fancy here. Hey, this this is the this is the golf hole that crushed us. You know, we won't talk about the decisions that have been made on this golf hole, especially in recent last week Sweet. <laughs> we don't talk about it we moved on from it lost some sleep over that golf shot you better believe it but we don't talk about it it happened we move on you can't change the past so leave it in the past and help shape the future which is what we are doing here what a golf shot this is where you want to be that'll work Okay, third shot. We're so close in this challenge, everybody. We are so close. 112 yards away, uphill 11 feet into a cross headwind. We don't want to land in the bunker. We've been there too many times. So let's go slight partial pitching wedge into an uphill lie. That's great. That is great. One of our best look at pars here. It's not going to be easy, though. Dialed in, didn't ya? All right, drop this on in and save your par. And it's an uphill putt. Now, look at that break, though. 10 feet, uphill, one inch. This is what we should have done last week, right? Might have been challenge complete last week, but you got to live with the decisions that you make, right? Not every decision on the golf course is a good decision. So more. Such a tough putt. Such a tough putt. One time.
Oh, man. You can see I got a feeling that it wasn't going to break that much. So I moved. I kept moving it to less break and just not enough. Good read, though. Okay, here we go. Four we are bogey. in this, everybody. We've had six birdies on the back before. We had three birdies last week, two birdies on the back nine. This one's tracking. All right, two over par at the moment. We've conquered the first gauntlet holes. One through six, two over par. That's incredible display of golf. We almost win, are one over on this at this one. point. But hole number five, that putt just, sometimes that goes. It just broke a lot more than it has in recent weeks. But like what usually happens on this golf course, you get looks that are just a little bit different than what you're used to. Just a little bit, enough to throw you off. Beautiful. There we go. Good I feel shot. focused today. Like I, I feel ready. Here on the seventh. I feel focused, and the big part I think of our success lately is being in the right mindset. And I, hey, I give you all a lot of the credit for that. Your positive, encouraging comments. You all know how much that helps me each week. Going and seeing those and being like, "Yes, come on, we got this." Appreciate Smart you all. Shot. And that gets me up fired 215 up. Yards out. 213 yards, uphill 6 feet. Okay, this is interesting. An inter interesting situation. A partial 3-wood is way too dangerous here, I think. Actually, I wouldn't say way too dangerous. Let's do a practice wing. Yeah, I don't think I would say way too dangerous. I think it's actually the safer shot. Because you don't want to land short in that bunker. One time. I don't think this is going to be good. No, John, you're wrong. That's where you want to be, which is where I was aiming for the right. Oh, I was hoping to hit the clip the one. green, but this is exactly where you want to be. This is basically the, the par city. If you hit this bunker shot right only at Central Park AG. Do you find bunker lies at 61 to 72%? that are not plugged bunkers, right? We, like, yeah, you had plugged bunker lies at like 20, 30%. But on this golf course, for whatever reason, these bunkers are extremely punishing even when it just rolls in. This course makes no sense. Let's make this. It just died. Here we have a 16 foot putt. It just died. Okay. That is unfortunate. Good thing that we're here, but what? Even, even the way the ball reacted, of course, with that 60 to 71% lie, you're not going to get basically any backspin. You get more forward spin. But how does the ball s stop like that? Out of that lie, even with the spin I put on it, how does the ball stop there? I would rather it have rolled back and give me a chip shot. <laughs> and the reason for that is because I've had this putt before and it's very unpredictable. And the chip is a basically an automatic make, like you make bogey, right? Putt could get away from us and roll all the way down the right side of the green. So, again, how does that ball stop there? Should have just rolled back into the light stuff. We put full loft and backspin chip. Chip it up. Maybe make it. Okay, at least we have a chance to make this. It's just not a lot of room for error. 16 feet. Uphill 4. Just can't overhit this whatsoever. This is a very difficult putt because of the uphill lie at the beginning. If we hit it too hard, we're done for. Yeah. Okay, moving on. Luck is on our side. You all don't we're understand. Well, 
The ro I would rather no, the reason is yeah, what you all don't see there right. on that putt. We hit the perfect speed. Any if that ball lips out that left side, it's gonna roll up that slope around, roll all the way off the back right of the green there. It does not stop. Very similar to hole number 12. That's the reason we needed that for luck. We needed that ball to roll back from the sand into the light rough, and then we chip it and we you can get it to stop before the hole and have a very easy bogey. Now we got a par, which is even better, but wow we got lucky that that lipped in because if that lips out or if we misread that you could probably say double triple bogey is in store <sighs> wow what a shot though what a shot what a nerve-wracking round everybody we are in this two over through seven What a week. Hopefully Come on. Sticks to With the how fairway. bad the swing's been this week, it feels nice. But I will say, last night, I spent like an hour at the range. Right before this round, I spent about an hour. Okay, about two hundred Shot after shot after shot. So to the pin. I do not want the swing to fill us. And I knew how bad the swing has been this week, so. Do I needed the practice. 215 yards, uphill 15 feet. Great chance to score here. Great chance to score. We need a little bit of luck. When I say a little bit, we need a whole lot of luck. Heading a little bit to the left on the approach. Got to bounce to the right. I think it's a bit too far out to the left. Yeah, if that hits about... Three feet well, to the right, kind of it's perfect. The mark a little bit. And now we're left Setting with the hardest our third golf shot. shot you would likely ever have to hit on this golf course. Believe it or not, you would think it'd be 12. Uh, we, we've had this shot one other time, or maybe two other times. One, I flopped it in, but we, we found out that if that flop shot would have missed... It would have been way too far, guys. We've had that shot again. So I'm going to do full lofted backspin lob wedge chip. We have to hit the fringe and get lucky. That's that's the only place you can land that. Uh, maybe a bit further, but still, I'm not All convinced right, it stops anywhere else. We actually have a chance. That was so nerve wracking. It actually hitting the rough helped us there. It actually helped us stop it. Wish it would have kept going a little bit, but if we hit the fringe, it might have stopped, but it's hard to say. 12 feet, downhill 2 inches, steady left to right. Cannot overhit this. But at the same time, we have to ask ourselves, do we want to win or do we want to lose, you know? Yeah, we can't hit it short, but we can't play it safe either. We're going to do this classic Ryan Gamer style. You remember classic Ryan Gamer? Classic Ryan Gamer. This is the classic Ryan Gamer. I haven't put like this in a while. Only in the Impossible Challenge. This is Ryan from Predator AG. And from the TGC Tours Platinum Rounds of the past. This one's on a good line. Such a good effort. That's beautiful speed. Oh, well, yeah. Good putt. Didn't quite make it there. Good putt. Okay, that putt's done. And you're three over on your round. What a battle. What a fight. If that ball hits in Let's the... See what happens here. We got a long par four A little for bit this further. One. A little bit less backspin from the rough there. It's beautiful. Okay, we have to hit the fairway here. We have to hit the fairway. Can't mess this hole up. This is the hole that will crush you. That's perfect. Off the cart path. Into the fairway, please. Don't go too far. We've got about 130 yards to go here. What do I always say? You gotta play... For me to beat this challenge, I got to play the most perfect round of golf I've ever played, but also had the luckiest round of golf. Luck is on our side today. 
Not playing perfect go golf, but we are playing good golf. Eight iron pitch shots too short, isn't it? Not necessarily though. Not necessarily. Yeah, I think it is. Unfortunate. But, you know, the beautiful thing about this golf hole is you can get this to stick. In this win, not you don't want to touch the loft stick. I've learned that the hard way. You do want to touch the backspin a little bit. One time. That's it. That's the one. That's the one, YouTube. It's going to stay. We have a chance at birdie. It's 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 going to roll, but it's still going to stay on the green. So like decent approach there. Good luck here. I would uh love to see you sink this one. It's a it's a big one. You all remember a time? Go back and watch the first 20 attempts. Our most conceded shot limit hole was this one. Believe it or not, it was this one. And number 12. <laughs> Actually, it's probably number 12. But I feel like number 12 is one of those where it always goes in at like the 8th or ninth attempt just to like, just to make you more mad. 39 feet, uphill 1 foot, steady right to left. Anybody got any ideas? I got an idea. Make it. How about it? How about it, Ryan Gamer? One time. That's perfect. That's perfect. There is no way that stops. Seven foot putt coming up. That's a, that's the, we've had that putt a lot, right? And I know where to put it. But if we just need a little bit more distance control on that, you want to send it up over that slope. Where we hit that ball, it, it slowed down too quick and it's going to stop. So you want to put it a little bit up so it rolls back behind the hole and back down. That was so close to being in. If we hit that about two inches further on the power, 1%, 2%, it's in the hole. And then we have a very, very scary par. Seven feet, downhill two inches, a putt we have to make. A putt we have to make. Yikes, that went right by. That's out of bounds. How does that putt not break? Ooh, into the drink. Welcome to Central Park AG, everybody. Okay, double bogey coming up. I mean, we had to give it a run, right? But I, I thought that was going in. This putt's going. That Down putt was goes. still... That's impossible. Did you all see that speed? That was still going to go out of bounds. You either make it or it's gone from there. But again, how does that putt stop? The first putt. And sitting at five over par for the day. Okay, the wind's blowing on this hey. one. Right to left. Remember that time in the back nine we had six birdies? Who knows? Come on. We have a lot of fight in us. We keep on fighting. Yes, that was our first true kind of... We've had some... Un interesting enough. We had luck on our side. We've also had some unlucky rollouts that just didn't make any sense. And that last putt was one of them. The fact that that thing stopped when the next putt that we hit just goes and I barely tapped that double bogey and it just went. I mean... 
Okay. We gotta birdie this. There we go. Great. We are contact. so close on this golf course, YouTube. We are so close. We're playing good golf. That is a beautiful drive, but like we're playing really good. It's just for me, Second it's got to take that perfect round. Coming up. I am going for this. 74% lie. You can't make this stuff up. I mean, still, I think we, we overpower this and go for it. But what are the odds we have a 74% driver lie right in the middle of the fairway? <laughs> I mean, this game makes no sense sometimes. That's beautiful. Some of you all were getting extremely nervous on that golf shot. And rightfully so. Are you kidding okay, me? Here's our third shot. Okay. All right. All right, Ryan. Another day at the office. Another day at the office. Another day at the office. Chip this one close. Be on your way. Dipping in would be fantastic. This would be nice. It could take you down to four over. We got lucky on the rollout there because the ball somehow stops before it gets to that yellow slope. It's like, it's honestly like the game after the last hole is like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ryan. I'll stop now. <laughs> I'll stop now, Ryan. Thank you. Thank you for that. I didn't even put backspin on it put barely any because i wanted it to roll up that slope we have a birdie look though 17 feet uphill 30 we did get lucky that it stopped there but honestly i wanted it to roll forward i don't, I don't know if you call that lucky we kind of did and we didn't come on one time we're having way better luck this week than last week, though. It's not even close. Ah, so, so close. Good. Pulled it. Look at the swing plane. Four feet it could have been a birdie. But you know the beauty of this. That is a par. There's your par. Sitting at five over par for your round. I need you all to call on the birdie train. Right to left. I'm not quite sure... It's been around since that one attempt where we had six birdies. That's the only birdie train we've had. But whatever birdie train company you all called that time, can you please call it back? Please? We're calling the ace train too. One time. Did the wind shift? Yeah, I want to say the wind definitely shifted on that one. And that approach was a bit wayward. Yeah, okay, it did. Second shot on the 11th. Okay. Well, we got to flop this full loft and backspin. Land it like right on that green slope. If we don't land it on the green slope, you can say goodbye to that golf ball. So I pulled it and fasted it, but the side hill lie, red side hill lie, did not even play. Okay. And wouldn't it be nice to save par on this? The good one. news is we're at a very makeable par chance here. It's, it's, I'd rather be here uphill than hitting back behind the hole in that downhill putt that's almost impossible. We've had that putt a lot, too many times, really. Come on, we can do this. Never give up. That 
zooming by the hole. I, oh my, I don't even, even know. The green I don't. I don't. <laughs> I don't understand what's shot. going on today with these green. With these. <laughs> that ball, we're hitting up a red slope, and I feel like I was going to underpower it. I might have overpowered it a bit, but did I really overpower it enough to do that? I don't know. Clearly, yes, but was not my intention. Go in, ball, please. Please. Yeah. Oh, your bogey. Getting that one done in style yes. with the chip shot. What's wrong with that? Finishing with style. Any momentum we can get, I will take it, even for bogey. Because if that. You all saw that speed that ball was generating, even with full loft and backspin, all that right, ball was gone. Six over for the day. The gauntlet. Imagine a birdie on 12. On you remember that time Ryan Gamer showed up on hole number 12, birdied, went on to birdie five more holes after it, and beat the impossible challenge on February 2nd, 2024. Nicely Imagine. done. You got some good contact there. Imagine. That was Ryan Gamer from the future with that speech. <laughs> oh, my. That's fine. That's fine. This gives a good look at the green from We've here learned that us. you full send this on the second shot because you want to be on this green as soon as you can, and you also never want to be on this green. So... That's Come perfect. On, give us a kick to the right. Just get lucky, please, game. Go in the hole for once. <laughs> Look, the game's like, uh, or, or you could just hang out in this spot. It, it's really nice down here. It's really nice down here, you know? You can hit it putt from here, and then Approach we'll put it right back in a similar fine. spot, and you get to hit that putt again. You don't even have to move, Ryan. This That's the score. It's <laughs> daunting, to say the least. Hopefully you can can this. The course is like, Ryan, what's not to like? You don't even have to move after your putt. Here we go. Daunting to say the least, John, is correct. We haven't had this angle in a while. It's not the double breaker. One time, Ryan, right here, right now. Please go in the hole. Looking very nice. Gave it a run. Hey, at least we didn't leave it short. We gave it a run. Just a little bit more break than I anticipated. Good news is that was for birdie. So we still got a chance for par. And hopefully we don't have any others. And you've got this left. Now we have the typical putt. On this one. The typical putt. You have the double breaker action. Right to left and left to right. But what makes it so tough. You know, I talked about this a lot. It, what makes this so tough is the fact that it's a little bit different each time. You never have the same exact putt, and it's different enough to throw you off. Anybody got any ideas? Oh, make it? Okay. I like that. Whatever one of you all that was. I can just imagine you all's comments on this on, on this series. Come on, Ryan. Wake up. Right here, right now. Oh, it could be. Yes! Way the sticks, it seemed, uh, we got the roll! Way to get that one in. The luck of lip outs has been on our side today. We've had a lot of good luck, Incredibly some bad luck, but a lot of good over. luck. Last week, we had par the worst luck we've one. ever had in this series. Are you kidding me? That's a par that feels like an albatross or an ace. If you one time that, you're watching this video here. What are we over? Almost 45 minutes, maybe more than that at this point. You're still watching. Thank you. You're never giving up. If you dropped a one time there, you're here. 
you all know what to do leave a comment drop a one-time exclamation mark it legends greatly appreciate all the support here on the gamer ability youtube channel I mean, we are getting every bounce. It's There's just up been a couple shots. Yards to a the couple pin. shots. If we had this luck last week, challenge would have been over. And you all know it. If we had this luck last week, that's a win. I think Lob Wedge is perfect here in this slope. This is going to be dialed in. It's honestly, swing has been really good. Swing has been better this week than last week. Well, it's been better this week in the Impossible Challenge. Not in anything else. Welcome to Central Park That's AG, everybody. Green, <laughs> Where it looks, you're, it looks like you're going to have a birdie putt. Here. And then the game just says, no. No. It's like AG is out there on the course, like, nope, nope. Like, yes, yes, give him that bounce. Yeah, give him that lip in. Oh, uh, what is he sitting six over right now? Yeah, give him that lip in. <laughs> what a legend that AG is. What a designer to, to create this golf course, Predator AG, and all the golf courses AG has created. What a legend. Let's make this shot. That was beautiful. Ooh, nicely done on it's the send chip it. shot. Now, one thing I will say. Okay, for the save. My practice on chip shots has helped. Short game has been much better. Have you all noticed that? There was a stretch there where short game was killing us. It's not short game. We're playing good overall. And that putt will go. We just have to play perfect. And you're sitting right at six over at the moment. Wind is blowing left. You know, the interesting right. thing is, I think this has been our most consistent round. We just haven't had, like, we haven't had the double. We had a double. We haven't had triples, quadruples. Like, we, we're pretty consistent this round. But consistent doesn't always mean challenge complete, obviously. You got to have more than consistency. You got to have an ace. Imagine. Nice, pure swing. You can't stuff. hit it any better than that. Come back, ball. Yep, come back. Well, that'll do for now. Here we go, 30 feet away. That ball hit into a red upslope on this golf course, Central Park AG, and stops. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Huh. Let's just send this into the hole. What a run! All right, here is a what a run! Our par putt. I can't believe that thing hit that heavy slope and stopped. This putt's tracking. A dot. Stop and, and that's jumped up that hill. Right there. What a stretch of golf! Like, look, very consistent. Not enough birdies, though. Very consistent. Not enough birdies. One of our most consistent round we have ever played at and Central Park AG. Unless and you play perfect, be a factor on this one's blowing right in. You better face. be birding, right? We are so close. I want to be done with this course so bad. Oh my! I never want to see this course again. Never want to see this course again. I thought today was going to be the day. I really did. And who knows? Maybe 15, 16, 17, 18. We, <laughs> we eagle, eagle, birdie, birdie. But, yeah, I, th I really thought today was going to be the day. I'm so ready 
to be done with this course and done with the challenge series. We are so close. I just, I can't wait for that celebration. It's going to be so awesome. The feeling of conquering this course. Yards to the pin. It feels so close. It feels so close. There was a time where I thought it was impossible, right? And I went through like, really like, this is impossible. And it is, but it's also achievable. Because we've been so close. Two over par. We've been these last few weeks. If you throw luck in there last week, we'd probably beat it. There's been a couple weeks. If luck was on our side, it's over. We are so close to being done with this golf course. We just have to keep fighting. We can't give up. Come on. We have it till the new game comes out. But all we'll need is next week. Tip 38. Lucky number 38. Is it a lucky number? I don't even know. What's the next lucky number, everybody? I thought 37 was a lucky number. Oh, that's beautiful. Speaking of a lucky... Well, it was lucky. We did have a lot of luck. That's fine. That's actually really good. Okay. This is what our third shot's looking like. Full off and backspin. Chip this one in, Ryan. Nice chip. Fantastic. Golf is a cruel game sometimes, YouTube. Golf is a cruel game. What a shot. Put that in the hole for It's too much backspin. Needed a bit more on it. Good shot, though. Let's We're dominating the, the back. We dominated the and back last you week. Are six over par at the moment. 16th hole is upon us here. Let's see what happens. You all know the crazy thing? I think this is probably our best, most consistent round on this golf course. I really think that this is the best we have ever played on this golf course. Am I crazy for thinking that? I think this is the best we've ever played. Like the most consistent. Yeah, we didn't have six birdies like that one round, but... This was a very consistent, very well-played round of golf. I like that. This is about 160 to the pin. We already... Okay, basically the ball is going to be here. So just go ahead and put it there. Right? Go ahead and put it there, right? No need to get fancy on this golf hole. That is a beautiful swing. Besides swing playing, but we are on today. The tempo is there. The distance control has been there. What a shot. You're getting so close. You know, it's it's so funny that the swing was so off this week, besides in the career mode series. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, nice approach. I pl had one of the clutchest yeah, comebacks can, I've uh, ever had down a five in a golf video game in the major championship this week. It was insane. That that back nine will be something we never forget. And I was hoping to continue it here into the possible challenge. And we honestly have. We've continued. That swing is on today. The swing has not been what's hurt us. Just a couple missed putts. A couple. We've had a lot of good lucks. A couple bad. Bad ones. But overall, good round. But we need more than good. We need perfect. We need perfect. Oh. That thing did not break in a, a centimeter. <laughs> yes! I tried to do that. Yeah, that. Yeah, I was uh, aiming past the hole, and I knew that it would roll back perfectly at that speed at that route. I'm back into the hole. <laughs> and you're currently sitting at five over. All right, stepping up to a par four here. <laughs> I'm telling you, this this course at this point, the course like, hey, come back, Ryan. Come back next week. <laughs> come back next week, Ryan. Are you, how many times? How many times have you all seen that same putt? Roll up that slope and not go in. How many times? 
it never it always looks like it's going to and it jukes left or right come back next week ryan <laughs> what a putt we are five over luck has been on our side this week and we play great golf we just haven't played perfect golf and you have to you have to play perfect golf Well, that's too bad. So 105 okay, blast. Check our well, distance uh, twice. Oh, well, John, uh, got lucky on that one, didn't we, John? <laughs> yes, we did, John. There's not much we could do there, right? Okay, let's get on to the green next. Okay, 111 yards, uphill 37 feet. Yards from the pin. It's going to fly about 12 yards further and less. I'm going to go up to a pitching wedge, and we're going to send this into the hole. Hopefully this one will bounce Great right. club. I knew we had the perfect club for it. The wind affected it more with that fast, but good shot. Here's the fourth shot. We've only got even on the back nine once. And well, wait, that's not true. That's not true, right? Haven't we got under par on the back before? Regardless, let's just make this to stay at even on the back. Swing plane was something to see. That's here. uh. Ryan was showing you all new technique there. Looking good. Okay, that's for bogey. So we are one over on the back. What a back nine. Look at the start to this round. And then we kind of... That... that what was the hole we all double right, bogeyed? That's six over for the deck. Was it six? No. Okay, this we bogeyed six. Pretty lengthy part. Is it five? five? We'll see. I, I didn't see it there, but... What a round. Hey, we fought we fought today, YouTube. This is there's a lot to be proud about in this round. This was one of I would say my most consistent and best golf I've played in a long time. Not making a lot of mistakes. Of work for you. Just not being perfect though. Time for and second shot at my skill 18. level. You know? I have to play perfect to take down this course. Right? And I, I realize that. Oh, that's, We're getting close, uh, though. Track. We're getting close. You know what's helped my swing, I think. I, I played a lot of Tekken last night. Tekken 8. And wow, it's turned my swing Don't around. <laughs> I mean, Tekken 8 has transformed my swing. This one's your third. I, I was... I was last, I, last night, I was doing those combo challenges. I was playing against the AI on very hard. I was getting upset. I was getting mad. And I was also celebrating some fight wins. And for whatever reason, apparently Tekken 8, I played it the night before. The golf swing becomes the best. You break a slump. <laughs> How do you all break a slump in PGA 2K23? New tutorial video. Play Tekken 8. That tutorial coming soon here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel. <laughs> Imagine you all open a YouTube video that says how to how to break a slump in PGA 2K23 and I open with Tekken 8. Oh my. Let's send this into the hole. That's it. <laughs> just nicely. Six feet to the cup. What an incredible round of golf. And no, incredible would be a challenge completion. But like if, if we were not playing Central Park right now, if we were playing any other course, if this was a course showcase video, career mode, I might have broke one of my records for one of the best rounds because of how the swing felt today.
Let's make this putt and finish with the birdie for momentum into next week. Seven over last week. We're six over right now with the chance to get to five. One time like you never one time before YouTube. Looking good. One time, baby! Out, your round is over. We conquered the back. We conquered the back. We are so close, YouTube. We are so close. That is that is an even on the back nine. Only done like once or twice in this series. We conquered the back. We needed to conquer nine. Nine was the double. Nine crushed us. Now, interesting enough, we hit less fairways this week than we had been hitting. Well, I think last week we didn't hit very good fairways. But before that, we hit like 90, 100, 80, 90. It was insane. So 78 today, 33 gurus is really good on this course. 1.44 putts per hole is amazing. A 77 five over, only five strokes off completing the challenge. And you erase that double bogey. Remember, we had a birdie chance. And I do not think that birdie... I think that birdie shot should have rolled right next to the hole. I do not agree with the way that putt rolled, but I never agree with anything on hole number nine, to be honest. That that hole makes no sense the way it rolls. Hole number one, two, nine, twelve, and a few other in between makes no sense in the way the ball behaves. But that is a very good round of golf. One of the most consistent round of golfs we play. Look at that scorecard. That is five pars on the front. We had three bogeys and a double... They're on nine. That's five over on the front. That really should have been possibly a two, two over or three over at worst. And then we go to the back. Number 10. We had a chance to birdie, if you all remember. We par, bogey, par, 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 birdie. That's even through the first seven holes of the back, including the par on 12, not to be overlooked. Almost a birdie. We got a par on 12, which is insane. We bogey 17, sitting one over on the back. We come out with an incredible third shot. They're putting it next to the hole and making a tough birdie putt. That's even on the back. There's going to come a time when we have to birdie the last hole. My prediction, when we beat this challenge, we are going to be one over going in to the 18th hole. And we're going to have a look like that for birdie to win the challenge that is my prediction there's a narrow margin in this course it is so narrow that the margin between even and 15 over is so small and as crazy as that sounds it's true there's gonna come a time here's my prediction we're gonna be probably two or three over on the front nine we're gonna start the back we're gonna birdie 10 and we're going to go on to birdie a couple, one other hole. We're going to be one over going in to the 18th hole. And I believe to complete the challenge, when that day comes, we need a birdie on the 18th. We've gotten a lot of birdies on the 18th recently. And I really think that that's how close it's going to be. Thank you all for all the support here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel. We keep fighting. We fought today. What a battle this was and played some great golf, honestly. But you know what? We did not play perfect golf. A lot of luck on our side today compared to last week. Some tough luck, but at the end of the day, we can't complain. The course gave us a lot today and we took advantage for the most part. If you got some enjoyment, drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more. And I have a full challenge series playlist linked for you on the description if you're looking for all other challenge series videos. If you did not watch the Predator AG series, you just you just came here on Central Park AG, trust me, go to that playlist. Watch the Predator AG challenge. Attempt one. Ooh, the final attempt 11. We can do this. We can do this. We're closer to this. Way more consistent here than Predator AG. I, I, I've said this multiple times. That course is a thousand times harder than this one because of how many shots, how many golf hoes you can concede shot limit on. There's like 10 golf hoes that you can concede shot limit on. So yeah, the last eight holes are very scorable, but you're probably 15 over or 20 over at that point. And... We are so close. We are so close. But in that round, a tip number 11, the reason I bring it up, because I had, I played the perfect round of golf and I had the luckiest round of golf ever. And that's what it's going to take for me to take down Central Park AG. 
We can do this. We keep fighting. Hey, tune into the Gamer Build a YouTube channel each and every day for new videos. Usually, I post the challenge, impossible challenge videos on Friday. It's not Friday every week, though. Uh, but I'm hoping to do at least once every two weeks or once a week moving forward. It'll depend on the schedule. And we have until the new game comes out to complete this. I'm hoping that our last Impossible Challenge video is next week. That's right. Next week. That'll be Super Bowl weekend where my Kansas City Chiefs are facing off against the 49ers in the Super Bowl. That's Super Friday. Oh my what a i don't know if there would be a better time to complete it imagine my hype beating already hyped up for the week with the super bowl coming up next week could be the one but if you want even more content from me check out my second channel gamer ability 2 i just i posted a full last of us part one series recently you can tune into that full series highly recommend it and i'm also working through a last of us part two remastered playthrough my first time experience experiencing those games and they're incredible and also been posting some tekken 8 content and plenty of other playthroughs and gaming content over there on the second channel as well i will see you all in the next video as always have a fantastic day everybody